Welcome back to The Sims 4 Growing Together. Today we are going to be working on adding more space to our house. I think we either need to go wide or we got to go up. Now, a couple of things to note from last episode. For some reason, I, I made the mistake and I, I did it twice in Creator Sim. Hey, why don't you have a hearing aid on your work outfit? <laughs> I feel like medical wearables should kind of apply across the board, but anyway. Anyway, so yeah, I made a mistake where I, I for some reason, took the hearing aid off party wear, but left it on swimwear, or I think it wasn't on swimwear as well. Anyway, I fixed that. Hearing aid is on the correct outfits. The only ones it's not on is swimwear and sleepwear. So that's fixed. Now, the second thing that was also a hot button topic, which I didn't know about. This is a bug I had no idea about. But with the family keepsake box that Hillary has that we put a bunch of family photos in, this has been a bug in the game for a while. And this includes like the chest from Discover University where you can put items in. You know, what? I, I think I need to demonstrate. So this chest from Discover University, it's the same functionality as the keepsake box. So in live mode, what I can do is I can like drag photos and put it in. I'm not gonna do it because I'm probably gonna break it. You can drag and put photos inside of here because uh, it has its own inventory. now. The bug is sometimes these photos will just become blank. They'll just go black and you've lost them forever. And that's already happened to a few photos that I put in the keepsake box, but not all of them. So oh, now I've wasted money on this, haven't I? How much did this cost me? <laughs> 130, I'm down to 104. Well, we might as well keep it now. I've wasted money on it. Uh, yeah, so what I've done, I have a members only video, which I do members exclusive videos every single week. If you're not a member, but you're interested in becoming one, there's already, I think, 15 exclusive members only videos about behind the scenes stuff. Uh, and this one was, I actually created my own custom CC photographs. So in all the different sizes. So I've got a medium one, here we go. So I got a medium sized one here for all our medium photos and I've got the large one here and I've already added a couple of photos to it. So this large one has a family photo and one of Ash and Willow hugging. Also got the portrait ones of the mountaintop climb with Brienne and Ray. So those are in here. So basically the reason I've done this is if we make these as CC items and I put it in to the chest, they cannot be like deleted unless I remove the CC from my game, which I won't do obviously. So that means this is gonna work. So I, not only did I do this, um, I'll show you, and I got the small, hey, I, oh, I need to clear my thumbnail case. I got the old thumbnail. Anyway, and I got small photos, actually a little big, but I can just scale it down um, here. So the other thing I did is so normal photos in game, if I were to get like this photo, I go to live mode, I can't, I can't move it, drag it or do anything with it, but I added the ability to all of these custom photos. I added the ability that I can just drag them around and I can chuck them in a chest. So that was something that I added on. We did that in the members video. So if you're interested in seeing how that's done, you can check it out. If not, don't worry about it. Basically all it means is I can now put photos into our keepsake box and not lose them. That's the idea. And they can also go in my Sims inventory. So they, they can sort of go, basically they work like normal photos except I have to sort of make them manually outside of the game, which is not so bad because I'm not planning on doing hundreds and hundreds of photos, but we will choose some nice core moments, turn them into these photos, we'll add them in. That's the plan. Um, and I guess for now, seeing as I've already, I've just paid for all this stuff, we might as well keep it. I've got a little elephant too. So yeah, that's the update. Uh, I'm gonna put the elephant in this toddler room. Here we go. Here you go, guys. Enjoy. <laughs> so I quite like this one of Hillary and Addison. That was one of the, that was that date on the pier. Anyway, I will. Do I have any? Did I leave any in here? No. All right. So I'm gonna leave these up around the house because obviously I need these to actually go in the keepsake box later when we own it. Because currently Hillary owns it, but I can't put stuff in it. So I'm just gonna just put one over there. I mean, I guess Brienne can hang out on the wall here. Why not? And Addison and and uh, Hillary can hang out there too. And we'll, we'll just add more photos. And oh yeah, I do. I'll turn these houses into photos as well. I think maybe not all of them. Maybe what I'll do is I'll make like a collage on a bigger one. Yeah, I think that's quite a good solution. I think that'll work for us. So thank you first of all for pointing that out in the comments. There was a, <laughs> a lot of people were worried about that. Thankfully we we didn't really lose any photos. We lost. I don't want to say it, but we did lose Reginald's. Uh, <laughs> university graduation photo. Remember how we lost his high school graduation photo? Yeah, now we also lost his university. So we have CC versions of both. So. <laughs> All right, anyway, back to the game. So what we're gonna do, well, we probably need to earn a bit of money to be honest. Uh, Koji is chatting, not what I need you to do. I need you to maybe review food or drink or write column. Let's write a column. Oh, you got like three days actually. Let's not rush into that. 
How are my babies doing? Uh, we probably should do a little cast makeover, hey? Just, just a little, so I can, and also, well actually hang on, when do they age up? Cause I, I know they just aged up, but how, lo how long have we got? So it'll be Thursday night, cause it's Thursday and then Friday, so it must be around midnight. Um, so quite a while actually. So you know what, Let, let's do a quick makeover. Alrighty, every day, what do you got? I like your hair actually, that's kind of fun. So I guess let's color code. I don't remember, what, I have no idea what colors we chose before, but we'll choose new colors. You're gonna be, you're yellow. <laughs> That's your color. There you go. Very nice. Quite like the top. Is there a yellow one? There is. Oh, that's cute. Oh, it's got like the matching pants too. Nice. Oh my gosh, you have a hearing aid too. What? Wait, yep. Yeah. Okay, so you've got a sleeping hearing aid, a party hearing aid, and that's it. Okay, so hearing aid, let's apply them. <laughs> I don't know, the game is so weird that it does this. And it's on the right ear for older. We'll do yellow, because that's your color. <laughs> okay, so we've got, oh, I've got a, the hearing aid here as well. Okay, everyday, yellow, formal wear, sleepwear, party wear, swim wear, hot weather wear, and cold weather wear. Very nice. Gosh, all my kids are like clones of each other. <laughs> you know what? I'm actually going to change their hair color. I think I'm going to go black. And I'm going to, so it's like Koji's hair. And I think I'm going to change Aspen's as well. Because they're twins. I don't know. I figured they'd have the same hair color. Let's also not do the creature creeper's hair. I don't like that. Yeah, <laughs> that's cute. All right, well, you're wearing blue. So let's just go blue. That's your thing. Okay, cold weather wear, hot weather wear, swim wear. Oh, that's kind of green, actually. That's not really blue. Blue. There we go. <laughs> Party wear, sleep wear, uh, formal wear, and every day. It's kind of blue, but anyway. All right, so Aspen is blue. I feel like I've definitely, I mean, I've obviously changed the colors, but I don't remember what they were before anyway, so we'll start again. Well, I guess because Aspen is blue, we have a blue bed. That means uh, Older will use the other bed. That works for me. All right, and now they've got black hair as well. I think at least when they grow up, we can tell the kids a part of it more. All right, everyone, you're gonna do your own thing. I, I can't take care of everyone at once here. So I'm gonna get um, Quinn to sell that to an art gallery, first of all, because that's worth a lot of money. So we might as well get some cash all out of that. Rye is in a pretty good mood. How's that laundry? Is that good? Unload and put away, clean and dry. Yeah, let's do that. Keep on top of that. Um, Koji, you need to do your column writing, please, instead of whatever you're doing. Comedy, nope, uh, not comedy. <laughs> Web, respond to mail. No, I need a writing. Oh, is it underwriting? Right, cop. That's what we're gonna do. Thank you. All right, Quinn, you still have your job, which we were supposed to kind of quit that a long time ago. The only reason we didn't is because it bugged after I said quit. So we were like, oh, let's keep doing it. But I, it's probably time to quit. Is it? No, no, it's not. We've got Addison and Hillary here, we're good. I need to discipline my toddler, child, or teen five times. So I think, was it help with needs maybe? Tell to eat something. I feel like one of these interactions helped this thing. Let's see. I really think you should eat. You should eat something. Oh, okay, you just got an apple. Hey, um, Willow, I've got an idea. Can you go here and I'm gonna, I'm gonna use you. Oh no, the kid's in the high chair. That's not a good idea. Oh my gosh, what happened? <laughs> what is going on? Okay, here we go, good. Now I just get Quinn to say, Parenting, discipline behavior, calm, ask you not to make a mess. There we go. And then that'll count as one time. And oh, oh, I think it's when they do their homework and you you encourage them for doing something good. That's when we, that, that also counts. But I, oh wait, do we, have we done our homework? Oh no, we haven't, good. You, if you do your homework. Okay, I'm gonna need, did you do your column? <laughs> what is going on in this house? Okay, write another column. I think you need to do two. Okay, Quinn, now they're doing their homework. So I say parenting, encourage. Here we go, encourage reason behavior, doing homework. So that counts as two, yeah. Can I encourage you for anything? No. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna need to give Older a bath because that is horrendous. <laughs> How are you going? You kind of need a toilet and eat. Well, oh, okay, potty help from, who's not doing anything? Addison, potty help, please. Ooh, family dynamics strict. What, because I'm giving them a bath? No, mm, I'm pretty strict. You gotta have your bath. Like I'm just taking care of my kid. Oh, look at that hug. Thanks, mom. Okay. Um, can I get you to clean that up maybe? Let's get this. Okay, kids having a bath, that's good. You're eating. How are you going? You can need to eat as well afterwards. Okay. Uh, everything's on track here. Everything's on track. Yeah, they're doing potty train too. So I gotta figure out how much, is that Trenton? It is Trenton, big wallet. Hey buddy, what's going on? Just hanging out in the street. Yep, just a 10 p.m. middle of the street in San Sequoia suburbs. Yeah, I've been there, buddy. <laughs> I've been there. Hmm. 
Sus. Okay. Um, hey, Rai. Okay, guys, it's not a family meeting in here. Like, don't all need to come in here. All right, Quinn, I'm going to need you to come back over here. Oh, Hillary's on the couch. Sure. Okay, I'm going to need you, Ash, to do homework. I'm going to need Quinn to encourage Kyra some behavior. Oh, doing dishes. Oh, yes, I'll do that. Homework complete from Willow. Well done. Gonna get some leftovers, maybe? Something to eat. All right, Quinn is encouraging. Well done. You've done a really good job. I'm very proud of you. And then I should also be able to encourage uh, homework too. That means we're four out of five. Oh, I can critically assess this photo of Brienne, <laughs> of Auntie Brienne. Hmm, not quite sure about this one. Um, I suppose it's okay, but I don't want it on my walls. All right, Rai, what do you got to do? Three comedy routines, comedy level six. All right. How, how have we never finished that comedy routine? I, I swear it's bugged. Maybe we need to start a new one. Can I, yeah, let me scrap the routine. Let me start a new one. Post shot routine. Maybe I need to finish it all in one go. Maybe that's the problem. Uh, what is going on over here? Are you, no, I can't do anything. I need to encourage or discipline. No option. Whoa, careful. Uh, who are you again? I'm gonna say Aspen. Oh, it's older, dang it, Aspen's blue. Okay, Aspen's blue because Aspen is cold, like the place. Is Aspen cold? What's the average temperature in Aspen? Uh, I guess it depends on the month of the year. I mean, in winter it's pretty cold. Average temperature of January is high of two degrees, low of minus 12 Celsius that is. Yes, Aspen is cold, therefore Aspen is blue, obviously. <laughs> All right, Quinn, no, no, why don't you use the toilet that no one's in? Addison is in the room. Okay. All right, you guys completed your homework, very good. Hey, um, actually, Willow, do you want to clean up the plates? Because then I can get Quinn to encourage that as good behavior too. That'd be good. That'd be something. And right, how's that comedy routine? It is, it is ticking along. All right, you've done everything you need to. You got work in three days. So that's actually kind of good. You got a bit of time off, which is nice. What's going on? You're talking in the mirror? We need to buy, oh, we need bicycles. So as much as I also want to do renovations, we definitely need to get bicycles for the kids because we need to teach them how to ride. How to ride. We got mountain bike. We've got a uh, trickster bike, I guess kind of like a BMX kind of thing maybe. Um, oh, so it's just mountain or the trickster. And then they have variants where it's like, One's got a basket, uh, this one's got the handlebars, and this one's got like a horn thing on it, and that's got a basket. I guess it's got, it's got pretty cool wheels. I like this one. Let's get this one for Ash, and then Willow. Uh, oh, that one's fun. This can be Willow's. Okay. Uh, I, I, think, I get it. They're kind of randomly at the front at the moment. That's okay. They, they're just going to their inventory, so it's fine. All right, so I'm going to get uh, Ash. This is yours. I'm going to say set as preferred bike, and I'm just going to put, I'll put it in my inventory. And then Willow, I'll set this as your preferred bike too. I'll put that in your inventory. And then we'll we'll do some training uh, during the day because it is Saturday midnight. So we'll get that sorted soon. Oh, you're having a shower. Okay. So I was just about to tell you to go to the toilet, but that's fine. Um, all right, Ash, uh, you can go to bed. So you're not that tired, but that's all right. Quinn. Oh, actually, hang on. Ash, was it you I need to? Hmm. You did do the dishes, but oh no, was it Willow? Oh, it was Willow. Courage for doing the dishes. And then that means Quinn can go to the next level of our aspiration. What are you guys doing? You're just hanging out? I like how our toddlers just kind of raise themselves. <laughs> it's my favorite, but you're kind of hungry actually. Let me get some food. Hey, do you want some of this? Are you hungry? How are you? No, you're good. Yeah, you get some of the... Oh, I can't encourage recent behavior because it got interrupted because she was busy showering. So, all right, we'll have to do something else. All right, can you just make another mess? So I can just get that done. Oh, cool. Rye finished the comedy routine. Fantastic. So I got to do three of those. How are you going? You're in a pretty good mood. Why don't we write a few more? Do another short routine. We've also got some Sims 2 music playing in here. You know, just Sims 2 theme song. It's all good. Nothing out of the ordinary. Oh no, Willow. How could you do that in our house? I'm going to have to discipline you. Calm. I'm going to hug it out. It's all good. <laughs> don't worry about it. Don't worry. Milestone complete. Hey, imagination level two as well for uh, older. Cool. So we are now... Wait, what level are we? Level six parenting. Um, help a child with school work for four hours. Okay, so when they get a school project as well, that would be easy. Have a child a character the character value. All right, well, we'll get there eventually. All right, I'm gonna get you to clean that up. <laughs> Thank you. And then you can go to sleep. All right, Quinn, um, you're pretty good too. I'll get you to take a shower. Let's get the hygiene topped off. Man, we really do have just plates everywhere in this house, don't we? Who left the chopping board on the floor in the kitchen? <laughs> <laughs> Such a mess. Uh, Koji, how are you going? You're pretty good. Can I get you to just do the laundry? Just, let's get ahead of the game. So let's get it done now before it piles up. All right, how are you guys going? All right, you need to go to bed. So I'm going to say, wait, which is blue bed. This one. Bedtime story from, oh. Uh, hmm. uh, what's Rai doing? Rai's writing. Maybe Koji, because Koji was doing the, the laundry. And I'll put that plate back in the fridge. Oh, actually, Quinn, can I get you to uh, clean up? Will that go in the bin? We need to put it in the bin. If you put it in the bin, we can get some money. Don't use the sink. Don't use the sink. Don't use the sink. Don't use the sink. Yes, bin. <laughs> Let's go. And uh, that will give us 
Crit? Oh, $10? Okay, and you just left that there. Right, you're getting a bedtime story. Where's my 70 bucks? I think people are saying it only gives me that much if I do it myself. Yeah, see, if I drag it with my cursor, I get 70. But if the sim does it, it's only 10, which is interesting. I, I don't know. Whatever. Uh, what are you doing in here, Quinn? Let's make another meal for the house, because I feel like we're sort of running low. Oh, okay, blocked. I guess Addison's cooking. All right, never mind. Oh, okay, hang on. Okay, now I actually need to discipline this. I'm gonna be firm, express disappointment, because you just saw Willow doing this, and I just told Willow not to do it. No making, where did you even get the flower? And I don't know, what, what is that? A like ketchup or something? Where, where did you even get that from? <laughs> I'm gonna put you to bed. You're not even tired, but I'm gonna put you to bed. Uh, oh, I was gonna say, you're not, the computer's not even on, but you're good. All right, one more comedy routine. Where did Hillary go? Is, is Hillary, oh, Hillary's up at the treehouse. Right, okay, fair enough. All right, Quinn, can I get you to clean that up? <laughs> and then, oh, then you're hungry. Oh, that's right, I was trying to cook. Ah, it's really, pe oh, we can evolve some plants out there. Actually, when when you're done with this, you're the gardener. We can we can do some evolution, which is pretty good. Um, oh, yeah, I totally should probably plant, uh, I guess we'll do it today, we'll plant a bunch of these Berries that we got from uh, Outdoor Retreat. Cooking level four, very nice. Uh, no, no, you can actually eat that. The whole point of making that was so you can eat it. Here you go, now put the rest in the fridge. Okay, cool, you've done that. So now, Rai just needs to achieve level six comedy. But before we do that, let's go uh, use the toilet, maybe take a shower. Yeah, Addison, you can clean that up. Addison just like picked it up, put it straight back down, and is like, well, that'll do just there. All good with me. All right, Quinn is actually in a really good mood. I'm kind of tempted to just read our herbalism book. Although having said that, what's, what skill level are we now? We're level five. I don't think level, we're gonna need to buy the next level book, I think. So I'm gonna do that. Cause it's gonna be easier than us trying to go to Granite Falls all the time. We got a level two book. Let's try that. All right, let's read this. Yeah, there we go. We're leveling up on that skill. So yeah, let's do a little bit of reading. Oh, there you go. They're cleaning up. Very nice. All right, um, Rye, let's get you out to the, pl just evolve this. Well, you don't actually need to go out there. Just evolve it. So that's excellent quality now, which is actually quite good, surprisingly. Don't worry, right? You'll have a bedroom eventually. <laughs> By bedroom, I mean an alcove. <laughs> well, I, I will try and get we'll try and get the second story today. I reckon we can do it. What happened to my kitchen? <laughs> there was like a pile of gut, like trash on the floor, and like there's puddles everywhere. Where are you going? No, no, do not sleep in the the, the treehouse. Why are they so determined to sleep in the treehouse? Like you have a bed. It's a sign to you. We're gonna need to get rid of that treehouse. Alrighty, welcome. You're awake. Unfortunately, your parents are both asleep. So. Actually, Koji can get up. Koji, let's go to the toilet. And then you're gonna go do some dancing. Well, we're gonna get Koji to help you learn ride a bike. You're gonna achieve mental level three. We do have to have a slumber party, but oh, we, I guess let's go to the rec center today, maybe. Maybe we can meet some kids or something because we need some friends. <laughs> they don't know anyone. So we'll have to work on that. All right, it is raining, so not the best weather. Is it gonna stop raining? I mean, I guess if we travel somewhere, it might not be raining. Let, let's take just Koji and Ash. Let's go to the rec center. You know what, Willow can come too. I probably need two two adults, so I don't know. Let's go one at a time. Let's go Ash and uh, Koji. Uh, okay, it is raining here too. Um, all right, let's go somewhere else. <laughs> I mean, we can still do it in the rain. It's just not very nice, is it? What about, where's a nice park? It's not a park, but why don't we go to the Big Wallet Family Cemetery? Because I haven't actually showed you what I added here, so. We did the video building the cemetery a little while ago. And if you want to check it out, I will try and remember to link it up on screen and in the description down below. But we finally got around to building the cemetery. I haven't done everything I wanted to do yet, but if you haven't seen it, we got all the Big Wallet uh, family members here that have passed away, unfortunately. Um, they're all hanging out here. We've got some special ones over here. We've got Lady Big Wallet and Wyatt Wale Skaggs. It's also raining here. Why is it raining everywhere? But I got around to making a custom content sign for the actual cemetery. Now you might recognize this logo. It's actually from the family tree that freaking Chaz over on Twitter always updates for us. So you, you might know it, let me show you. So this is the Big Wallet family tree, which you might've seen posted up over on Twitter by at freaking Chaz just there. So they will often come back, update the family tree and you can see everyone, what sort of series they're from, how they're all related. Uh, but anyway, at the top of this is this logo, which is like, I guess the code of arms of the Big Wallets and freaking Chaz just designed it themselves. And I thought it would be really cool to have that element within The Sims 4 as well. So thank you for that sweet design. But just jump into build mode as well. I did uh, do a little, uh, got a little, oh. <laughs> so I've got a little credit, but my head is literally in the way. A little credit art by at freaking Chaz. Thank you so much for this, it is amazing. And at nighttime, it does also glow, which is pretty cool. So it's like a transparent glowing sign. 
And I believe that does say Big Wallet Cemetery in Simlish. I, I did this a while ago, but I'm pretty sure that's what it says. Um, but yeah, that was a lot of fun. All right, well, I guess coming here was kind of pointless because we are not going to be riding a bike while it's raining. I guess we could go to the desert. <laughs> it won't be raining there. What about Del Sol Valley? That's got a nice little park down here. Ash is just like, but dad, I just want to ride my bike. Why is it raining everywhere? This sucks. This is the worst Saturday ever. Oh good, it's not raining. Here we go. Don't worry, son. We're here. <laughs> All right, let's get your bike. It's time. Ask Koji for help riding bike. All right, please, can we ride our bike now? Please, dad, help her. All right, here we go. That is a sick bike, by the way. Can't believe that it only costs 100 bucks. That's sweet. All right. Oh, hey, can we customize the helmets at all? Is that something we can do? Let's go. Uh, Kind of look a little sad. I guess you're scared because it's the first time. So Koji, do you want to actually help or are you just going to stand there? It's like, but I am helping. This is how I help. Uh, yep, you're doing great. Just keep doing that. Keep wobbling. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, okay, now do this. That's not good advice. Oh, we can go on the swings afterwards. That'll be fun. How's Quinn, do not Quinn, <laughs> sorry. You do look like your mother though. How is Willow doing? Willow's actually in a great mood. I'm gonna bring Willow here. I didn't think we're gonna do it once at a time, but let's bring Willow over here as well. Why not? Oh, actually speaking of which, yeah, let's meet some f uh, kids. Willow, let's meet some people here. By people, I mean kids, because we need to have a slumber party. Hi, I'm Willow. I live in San Sequoia. Did you want to come to my slumber party? Why are you talking to me? Can you leave me alone? You're making me cry. Look at my lip. Please leave me alone. <laughs> Oh, there we go. They're happy. All right, let's swing together. That'll be nice. And how are you guys going? Oh, look at that. They're hanging out with the swing set in the background. You guys are going pretty well. Oh, whoops, sorry. Your skill is building pretty quick when you got the, the help from the parent. So I believe that the skill on the bike is actually tied to the motor skill. So the the higher that is, I think the better they are at riding bikes. Hey, there we go. Um, has achieved another level in swimming. Wait, what? Okay. <laughs> All right, that's a... Uh, guys, hey, good job. Uh, yeah, not, okay. not swimming, but anyway, ignore you know the swimming part. Going pretty good. Quinn is off to work. Good job, Quinn. Are there any other kids hanging out here, by the way? How do we go? Is that good? Put an in inventory? All right. Hey, Willow, it's your turn. Thanks, Dad. Hang on. Friendly, affection, hug lovingly. Oh, you are my favorite. That, I mean, that's under affectionate, but that kind of sounds like a bit of a backhanded compliment. Not backhanded to Koji, but backhanded to Mom. All right, now, that was cute, wasn't it? Now, do you want to go meet, who is this? I don't even know the name. Orion, Orion Michelson, that's an amazing name. So the Michelsons, those are the new Sims, right? In San Sequoia, which actually bad news, I did kick them out of their house. They don't actually have a house anymore, uh, but they still exist. <laughs> it's, it's just cause I had to build a new house for when we move. All right, uh, affection, hug lovingly, there we go. All right, and then we're gonna get you to learn how to ride your bike as well. Okay, why is there some random adult swinging with this kid? Hang on, you need to go. Say hi to them. What? Okay. All right. So Ash is heading over there. Now I need help with my bike riding. Dad, it's my turn. You, but dad, you promised. Uh, uh. So is there only one kid here? Are there any other kids in this world? Someone's bike is over there. I feel like that's probably mine. Hey, social level seven. Fantastic. Uh, oh my gosh, it's Kenji <laughs> from the high school years. Let's play. He was one of the models of Brienne. Also, I believe here. Yeah, we got Lady Big Wallet the seconds tile. Do we have any other? Oh, we got Reginald Big Wallet tile. Uh, I think those are it. I don't know if I had any others. No, those are all blank. But yeah, <laughs> both my Sims are there. Very nice. Alrighty. Okay, so you want to climb over? Oh my gosh, look at her helmet. That's so cool. Uh, wait, where'd your friend go? Did they ditch you? I think they left. Chat. No, don't chat while they're trying to learn how to ride a bike. Okay, Orion ditched us. Can I like encourage as well? Not really. I can just kind of go here and do nothing. Actually, Ash, you're like dressed like Ash Ketchum. Do you want to see if you can catch what's in? Oh, we can't dig as a kid. Okay, because there is a dig pile there, but I can't use it. <laughs> what about the birds? Can you do anything with those? Hang on. No, that's just a... Uh... Oh, wait. Chase flock. Here we go. Yeah! All right, you do that. We're learning how to ride. It's all going pretty well. Hey, Kenji. Um, I'm trying to learn how to ride my bike. Why are you standing right where I'm cycling? Dude, can you move? <laughs> no, don't. Why? Is... Ah, the birds. Kenji, leave me alone. Why is this? Don't talk to my kids. It's weird. <gasps> kids, there's kids. Oh, that kid's back, Orion's back, who are you? Oh, Sandalwood, <gasps> oh my gosh. That's really exciting, Sandalwood has grown up. So we left Sandalwood in that Let's Play as a, as a toddler and Sandalwood is, I believe, I gotta hang on, I gotta pull up the family tree again. Yes, okay, so I just checked the family tree. Sandalwood is actually the same generation level, I believe, wait, actually, wait, no, no, I don't think that is true, hold up. No, 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 it, it is, it is. Okay, we're good. <laughs> yeah, so Sandalwood is actually supposed to be the same generation as Willow and Ash, so this is fantastic. We gotta, we gotta meet. 
We gotta meet Sandalwood. Heck yes. So Sandalwood, if you don't know, and if you haven't been watching my series in the past or you're new here, they are actually from our werewolves let's play. Uh, and they live over in Moonwood Mill with parents Nina and Uncle Angus. So they live over there and they're descendant from our Cottage Living Let's Play as well. That's where those Sims are from before that. Stop, Kenji, leave me alone. Go away. You're such a creep. I'm trying to meet Sandalwood because we actually need to meet Sandalwood because then we can have like family reunions and stuff. Uh, okay, Koji just ditched the kid on the bike. <laughs> Go, Koji, what the heck? All right, we're gonna reunite the family. All right, activities. Play make-believe. That's cute. All right, you're getting off the bike. Make sure to put that back in your inventory, please. Thank you. Right, I'm gonna need you to meet the other kids as well. Willow, do you wanna go meet the other kid in the swing? Because we, we need to get a bunch of these kids. Oh my gosh, look at all these kids. There's so many kids. Yeah, I gotta make sure I say hi to all of them because I need them all at my summer party. Especially Sandalwood. How are you guys going? So I'm pretty sure Sandalwood will be a werewolf as well. Oh yeah, Sa sorry, I, I didn't mention. Sandalwood is the son of Nina, Big Wallet but also Greg, the werewolf from uh, the werewolf world. <laughs> so there's also that. All right, should we, hang on. Let's go here together. Let's just join, join the other kids. All right, so have you met everyone here? Let me just check. Uh, yeah, yep, and yes, good. I know everyone here. Uh, Will, I'm gonna need you to meet Sandalwood as well. And also Ash, do you wanna meet all the other kids as well? Probably a good idea. Cause then we can actually all make friends. Hey dad, what you got there? Mushroom steak, really dad? You made mushroom steak? We're a bunch of kids, we don't want mushroom steak. The heck? <laughs> All right, Willow, did you meet Sandalwood? Yes, good stuff. Oh, actually Koji, I need you to meet Sandalwood too because we need like, I guess we, whoever's gonna be planning a family reunion, I need them to know the family members and they need to know them really well. So I should get the parent to meet them as well. All right, look at, this is a pretty good crowd. Oh, hey Addison. This is a pretty good crowd. So that I'm happy with that. Let's, can we plan a slumber party for tonight? Cause it's Saturday. Only a teen or older sim can schedule event. Wait, how do we do a slumber? Hmm. Does that mean I need to make sure Koji knows all these random kids? Let me just make sure Koji knows everyone. Okay, you know them. Yeah, I actually do know all of them, which is good. Okay, okay, okay. So, Koji, an event, slumber party, <laughs> yeah! Host, Willow, guests, uh, kids, obviously. Why is this bear in my friends list? All right, we need Orion, Krista, Koai, Estevan, Sandalwood. Oh, and uh, do I need to invite Ash? Six guests, pretty cool. All right, location. Uh, will be our home, and I guess we'll start it at 7 p.m. Or should we go earlier? Five, maybe? Let's do five. <laughs> yeah, this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be cool. I'm excited. All right, let's go home. Kids, we're gonna go home. We've got other stuff to do. We're gonna go make money, is actually what we have to do. Wait, <laughs> Willow, did you bring your bike? <laughs> okay, Willow, do you have your bike with you? Oh, you do. Good, good, good. And so does Ash. Fantastic. All right. So, uh, money making wise, we need to make money. Um, Oh yeah, actually we're doing a big slumber party. I need more room. Okay, well, here's the thing. If I was to build it upstairs right now, I don't know that that's really gonna give me more space, but the suggestion was we could put the guest room upstairs and then I guess we could turn this into like a second like living room area. So maybe we could have the slumber party in there. So, well, let's see what we can do. We got $2,000. We're not, we're not doing too shabby. I can't, I can probably get rid of some of this stuff in here. I've just been, what if I have a plate of food in here? Get out of there. <laughs> I can get rid of some of this stuff if I want to. All right, so second story, let's see. Obviously it's gonna cost a lot of money. Well, where can the stairs go first of all? I'd probably want them down the hallway, I reckon. So that means the second story would be over here, right? But that's kind of weird. Where, where would it look good? Let's try that first. How much is this gonna cost? Actually not too bad. Let's do a $1,200 room, for example. Problem is we won't get many windows if it, the upstairs is there. So maybe it actually makes a bit more sense to have it over here somewhere. And actually if I pitch this roof a little bit more so it lines up with this and we can extend the roof on the second level. Actually, you know what? No, I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna grab this. Let's just see what this looks like. <laughs> it looks bad. But if I, can I go, how much more can I afford? And that bit. All right, so I can afford that. <sighs> I'm gonna be honest, it does not look great, does it? Um, but it's all a work in progress. So maybe, maybe that's okay for now. Can I afford to paint it? I can, but I think I wanna do, what if I did like this on the second story? Do I like that or do I not like that? I don't, I don't know if I like that. Kind of almost want it to be like this dirty, like wood panel. <laughs> I kind of like, I kind of like that. What about more like brown though? No, do the white. Look, we can upgrade it as we get more money, okay? I don't think at this point I can even afford stairs, to be honest. Oh, this chair popped off the computer. Um, all right, well, that's there. That's a pretty big space, so I'm pretty happy with that. I mean, we could also use it as the slumber party room, maybe. So if I were to put stairs in the hallway, 
they'd be kind of in the middle. Like they, they probably need to be here. Let me move these photos, which don't worry, we'll take another photo of the house in a minute. Um, stairs, how much a stairs gonna cost me? Actually, the other thing is I need to plan, if we're gonna do stairs, we need to plan where the alcove is gonna go, which I guess ideally should probably be over this side because then we could have a window behind it. So really the second story needs to be over there. Yeah, hang on, maybe this works. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. <laughs> that looks worse, looks much worse. I think I'm gonna do that. This needs to be longer. It needs to go the whole way, I think. That's not working for me at all. All right, we gotta, we gotta, all right, let's just stick with this. We'll have to figure out the alcove later, I think. All right, let's get cheap. What are cheap says? Are these cheap? $96, that is pretty cheap. All right, cool. So I'm gonna put them, what if I put them there? I know it's kind of blocking that hallway, but what if I then put an archway there? So then the archway sort of tucks underneath the stairs and it kind of fits. I think I'm gonna do more like those stairs. Probably looks a bit better. All right, for now, I'm just gonna sort of, Smudge these on the wall. We'll we'll figure out a better solution later. Um, all right. So if we have those stairs there. I'm gonna have to make sure that door works. I'm not sure. I'm actually not sure that it will, but we'll test it. Uh, stairs <laughs> don't really match, uh, do they? Hang on. Is there a better color? I like the. Mm, we like the lighter color. Mm, that is the lighter color of the rail, which doesn't matter. I, actually, we need the um, cottage living one probably because that will match those columns or not. Maybe it's, oh, it's probably just the lighting actually. Yeah, they match with the lighting a bit better. All right. Oh my gosh, it's so dusty up here. Holy moly. All right, we're gonna do one line up there because it's all we can afford, but we have space upstairs now. No railings or anything, but we, we got space. That's exciting. So I guess eventually we need to probably move the stairs maybe over here because that might work. We'll obviously we have to expand the upstairs. At the moment, we can't really have an alcove, uh, but we have room to go upstairs. Now, can we get down the hallway? <laughs> That's kind of important. Can I go here? Great, I can. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, let's get the mail because apparently we've got a bunch of mail. Now you kids, uh, you're fine. You're just sad. Um, can I uh, help? No, not help. Uh, can I get you to read me a book? Book help, Charlotte's Pig from Addison, please. I'm a little bit sad. Okay, or not. All right, never mind. <laughs> All right, well, I tried to do the book thing, but that's fine. All right, we collected stuff from the mailbox. What do we have? Do we got some good junk we can sell? We got a bunch of toys, which we could sell. Just saying, because I mean, 270? Do you mind if I do? <laughs> Thanks, Grandma. <laughs> okay, those stairs are the wrong color entirely. Don't worry, we'll, we'll change it, we'll change it, okay? We'll, it's a work in progress. Oh, look at it. These guys are like best friends. Uh, Addison, did you just break my tub? Okay, now you're just leaving, you're like, oh, something's wrong with the tub. I don't know, I just walked in there and it was broken. It was just like that. <sighs> All right, thanks, Addison. <laughs> it's like, well, why are you in a towel if that wasn't you? <laughs> Let me fix that. Right, scavenger parts, please, as well. Let's get some free upgrade parts. All right, let's go clean that up. Okie dokie, so, well, let's go up here. Oh, yuck. We also don't have any windows up here, by the way. Let's go vacuum this area. Uh, ooh, oddly heated discussion. An artist who uses odd mediums such as dirty bath water and curdled milk is always trying to engage Quinn Markovic in a heated discussion. Uh, should Quinn argue art theory or with her or ignore it? Just, I mean, just ignore it. It's an artist. Art is art, you know? They paint in relative peace. Yeah, there you go. I mean, it's art. Art can be whatever you want it to be, you know? Cool, it's, it's like spores up here. Hey, social level five, nice. Uh, we might need to do more than just a vacuum, to be honest. All right, unwelcome present. I got a present I think is dumb. I want to trade it. Uh, sure, give it to someone else. <laughs> go for it. Yeah, just don't tell the person who got it from. Uh, it's still dirty. Deep vacuum. What time is this slumber party? Was it seven or five? 5 p.m., okay. So it's nearly slumber party time. Can, can you clean this room already, please? What's going on? It, it just got dustier. There's dust bunnies in here now. <laughs> All right, hang on. <laughs> I've got, I got a little bit of money from those toys. Let's see if we can at least complete the uh, the upstairs with like flooring and walls. I'll just do the same. Nothing spent. oh my gosh, that's all my money. All right, well, we got flooring and walls. Uh, I was gonna put a fence up here, but that ain't gonna happen. All right, I've gone for a darker stair. I think that looks better. Dad is like frantically vacuuming. He's like, oh, there's kids coming over, <laughs> quick, quick. <laughs> okay, the kids are nearly here. How is this gonna work? I, I don't know. 200, oh, $280 from work, sweet. Summer party's about to begin. Are you ready? Let's start. Okay, get some sleep. Okay, well, we'll do that later, obviously. Have Sims chatting at the same time. Have Sims playing games at the same time. Ooh, games. Uh, you know what? We could probably get a, a games table. We probably should, actually. Oh, uh, can I afford one? Well, the kids one is 55. How much is the new one? 300? Okay, let's get the kids one. <laughs> okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna make this the game, like the kids room. Guest room is now upstairs. Um, <laughs> and <laughs> there's no windows or anything. Look, we're, wor we're working on windows. Oh, I'm having the light. I need the suitcase. We're working on windows and, and railing, okay? We just haven't got that yet. Microphone, I guess, can... I can say in this room, because this is going to be like an entertainment room, right? So, now we need cheap chairs. Here we go, the kids' chairs, that, that makes sense. All right, this is all blue. Let's maybe change it a little bit. Should we get, like, fun different colors? Yeah, 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 that, that's cool. That's better. Mix it up a bit. All right, wallpaper. Maybe get some spots. 
for funsies. Some of this. So this, in essence, this is kind of like an extra living room, really, more than like a bedroom. So that's, I guess that's what I'm going to sort of use it as. Uh, I can't really afford anything else though, so... <laughs> <laughs> We've got toys. All right, let's let's see if we can play some games. So Willow is actually the host. So let me wait till everyone shows up first of all. Let's change the game to puzzles because that's new. Oh, they're going upstairs, guys. It's not safe up here. No, don't don't play in my dust, Sandalwood. <laughs> I feel like this room is not going to be vacuumed. All right. So we've done that. Now, I gotta, do I have to greet everyone or can I? Oh, actually puzzles kind of work a bit differently. Let's just do Don't Wake the Llama, hang on. Have Sims eat, oh. <laughs> Quinn just passed out out here. Oops, sorry about that, Quinn. Uh, you're gonna need to, once you wake up, go to bed. <laughs> and Koji, I'm gonna need you to keep working on the vacuuming, but I also need you to maybe serve food for everyone. I'm gonna get you to cook. Actually, we probably need to do gourmet cooking. Let's do butternut gnocchi. That sounds good. Yeah, these kids are just eating one. So we've got one kid playing games, which is Ash. One kid is eating. All right, we'll do it at the same time soon. All right, so we're going to play with, here we go. Orion, Sandalwood, Esteban, Koai. Oh, we can only do three, that's right, fair enough. All right, well, whatever. The others can do something else. All right, guys, let's play Don't Wake the Llama. It's going to be fun, all right? Hey, guys, you want to you play Make Believe? Hey, there we go. Have Sims watch TV at the same time. Oh, actually, I can do that. Hey, how about this? Why don't we say watch movie with, let's watch The Adventures of Spaceship Simulation. So who have we got? We got, oh, I don't know who that was. I think it was Krista, and I don't know who the- wait, who's the other person? Who we got? We got Krista and Koai. And was it someone else? No, I think everyone else is in here. Uh, I'll take care of you in a second, uh, older. Don't worry. <laughs> I'm busy with the slumber party right now. Okay, so Krista and Koai. Yeah. I assume watching a movie counts as watching TV, but we'll see. I have Sims chatting at the same time. We haven't managed that, unfortunately. Tell stories on a sleeping bag. We don't even own sleeping bags, so that, that'll be great. That'll work. Oh! <laughs> this is actually a pretty cool- I actually quite like this room. If we have more money, it'll be very nice. All right, dance to music. Yeah, let's do it. Hang on. Let's go over here. Let's say- no, no, don't, oh, turn on. Turn on uh, <laughs> electronica. Let's turn on some sweet kids radio. How do I get everyone to dance? I guess if I add them to my group, let me form groups. So we're going to go Ryan, Sandalwood, Estevan, and... Oh, that's it. Yeah, those three. Yep. And we're all going to go here. And we're going to go dance together. How's the movie going? Oh, yeah. We're back to watching movies in Sims 4. Let's go. We've already got silver and we haven't even done the sleeping part of the slumber party. I mean, kind of, we've got kind of two separate friends. I, I feel like probably the ideal number of guests is probably like three because uh, you only need three people to do stuff at the same time. I think I invited too many people, but you know, that's fine. We're having a good time. Okay, is, does this not count as dancing to music? Turn on a stereo and dance is what we're doing. Wait, we, why are we listening to, are we listening to classical? Tell <laughs> classical. Okay, I guess this doesn't count as dancing for some reason. All right, well, let's not do dancing then. All right, have Sims eat at the same time. Wait, did, Koji, did you ever make food? What happened to that? <laughs> did, did that happen? How much food do we have? Two servings? Oh, Koji's over here. I don't know what's happening with our toddlers. I don't have time for the toddlers right now. Um, okay, Koji, I'm gonna need you to do that again. Cause I was, I guess I was just- Tell stories on sleeping bags. All right, well, why don't we say, how can I get, wait, let's get everyone. There's definitely not enough room in this house for all the sleeping bags that is a problem let's just see what happens shall we let's say you know what i need to do i'm pretty sure this is bugged because we didn't have a room up here what i'm gonna do dust system let's turn it off the old trick of turn it off and on again there you go all good oh yeah there's no railing can i afford railings <laughs> can i afford to safety proof my house oh i'm using the cottage living one aren't i how much is the cottage living one 20 bucks it's actually pretty good sweet <laughs> I can't afford to go all the way along, so I'm just gonna go there. I <laughs> just have that bit that's not safe, but whatever. All right, so I guess this is the guest room. Um, Addison and Hillary, I hope you don't mind all the kids coming up here too. So what I'm gonna say, I'm gonna get you to say go here together with all the kids, or at least the ones in my group. Oh, there we go, we did the dancing. It was when we finished dancing, it counted. You guys are still watching the movie, so I'll let you guys keep doing that. All right, what's going on with my toddlers actually? Okay, you, oh my gosh, okay. Uh, you need potty help. Hey, uh, Addison, potty help please. You, oh my gosh, you need bedtime story from uh, Hillary because Koji's gonna be busy making food for everyone. All right, kids are going upstairs. Oh, this is the chaos we need in this house. All right, so now what we're gonna do, whilst we're up here, ask guests to set up sleeping bag. Does that mean I've, uh, okay, you can't and I can't. Oh, there's one, okay. Oh, there's another, I think, yep. I think we need more room in this house, I'm gonna be honest. Oh, there's one in the kitchen, okay. <laughs> right. Oh, Sydney's here, what the heck are you doing here? Likes kids radio music, sure, Koji. Okay, where are the other ones gonna, is someone gonna, oh no. Are you setting up on the balcony? Oh my gosh, no, no! <laughs> Uh, I can move these, right? Yes, okay, good. Yeah, the problem is, yeah, they take up quite a lot of space, which, I mean, what, Willow, what? 
<laughs> Willow's just got a bed. Uh, okay, this other one, I guess is getting, oh, okay, yeah, we got too many kids in this house. Okay, you're gonna have to sleep in the parents' room. Is that cool, guys? Okay, is that everyone sleeping? Oh no, are you sending them on? Oh no, there's one out here too. Um, hmm, maybe you can, maybe it works with move objects. We'll put it there, we'll see. All right, we got three upstairs. Yeah, I think a slumber party with maybe three kids is better. All right, how's that food coming? Cause we'll get around to eight. Okay, you need to get up, but we weren't actually going to bed yet. It's only 8 p.m. Tell stories on a sleeping bag. Well, how do I do that? Oh, I so say tell story, fairy tale. I'm gonna tell it to, wait, who's, who's up here? We've got Esteban and Krista. All right, tell story. Let's tell a story about a deep sea monstrosity with Esteban and Krista. Let's see if that works. Okay, good, we're getting no sandalwood more. That's good, that's good. <laughs> God, this house is just crawling with, look how many Sims are in my house right now. I don't even know why Sydney's here. Sydney just is here. Now oh, something just broke as well. Oh, my stove. Well, did you finish cooking first? Oh, no, 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 get out of my fridge. I was just making food for everyone. I'm gonna say call a meal. How's that story got? Okay, I'm just by myself. Great. So that worked. Guys, guys, I was gonna tell a story. All right, let's go eat. Oh, they're here. Okay, sorry, story's over. <laughs> It's eating time. Oh my gosh, this is a mess. I'm gonna get rid of that plate. 70 bucks, let's go. Money making scheme. Okay, so we've done that. So the last thing we gotta tell us, we, oh my gosh. Guys, you can sit at the table. We have a table. <laughs> and who set up a sleeping bag in the kitchen? Is there enough Sims in this house right now? With this sleeping bag in the middle of the room? <laughs> Do we have enough people here? We're gonna run out of food. Yep, we've already run out. And you didn't even get any. All right, I'm gonna let everyone eat. Wait, where's that other toddler? I just saw a toddler glitch. There they are. Oh my gosh, you gotta go to bed, dude. Sleep. Oh wait, you're hungry. Do we have food in the fridge? All right, we're out of food. All right, well, you're gonna have to go to bed. I'm out there and you, oh wow, you have to pee real bad. All right, now, so I believe the way slumber parties work. So Willow is a host. It is now, it's like 10 p.m. I think I go more choices. Okay, ask guests to set up sleeping bags. Guess get slumber party snacks. Oh, cool. Time for bed. Uh, yeah, let's do time for bed. So all these kids are just gonna go to bed. We didn't do the story, but we did get gold. So that's pretty good. All right, Koji, I need you to go to bed. Or not bed, toilet. And then I need you to fix that. <laughs> Cal, oh, that's good. That's ashes. I was gonna say there's a random kid in my parents' room, but no, it's just ash. That's fine. That That's okay. At least we don't have kids out in the lawn. That was pretty bad. <laughs> all right, we're gonna... This is good to know. We're gonna need a dedicated slumber party space for everyone. Um, good to see these are all working. Is this one working? Yeah. So they have a big area they need access to, but it seems like they can get in it anyway. So that's all good. Wait, where is your sleeping bag? Is it upstairs? No, do you have one? If this kid set up a sleeping bag, I don't know where it is. No, 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 Koji, I need you to go fix this and you need to make food <laughs> still. Okay, I'm gonna turn that off because I'm pretty sure the kid's trying to sleep and I can't. Oh, they're just gonna go hang out. Okay. All right, there we go. We fixed that. Okay, I'm gonna need you to make some more food because the kids cleaned us out. Let's make, I don't know, something toddlers would eat. <laughs> fish and chips. Hey, let's make a bunch of fish and chips. So yeah, there's two kids that aren't sleeping. Though Koai does have a thing that they were sitting on it. No, actually Sandalwood was sitting there. Maybe they'll go to bed now. Let's see. Yeah. Okay. Well, I don't know where Sandalwood's gonna go. Uh, because I'm pretty sure they don't have a sleeping bag as far as I'm aware. Wait, why is Addison in my bed? <laughs> Addison is it's in Ash's bed. Get out of there. Okay, Sydney's heading home. All right, that's good. All right, we, we made some fish and chips. That's good. All right. All right, so who was hungry? Oh my gosh, your hygiene. Oh my god. Okay, well, you're both hungry. I thought you both got food. All right, that's right. We'll, we'll wake them up and we'll get them some food. Grab grab that. God, <laughs> there's so many people in this house. Yeah, okay, good. Now you get up. Yeah, you, you get some of this as well. There you go. All right, I'll put this back in the fridge. All right, then once you've eaten, you can go back to bed, but you need a bath real bad. All right. You're going back to school. It's only 1 a.m. <laughs> There's so many people up at the moment. All right, Rye, I need you to give a bath to uh, Aldo because Aldo stanks, dude. God, how would these kids sleep in this house? Especially this kid. There's three people around them in the kitchen eating. <laughs> All right, let's clean up some of this mess, please. I'm right, getting the bath. Oh my gosh. My <laughs> what is going on with my tub? I'm pretty sure Addison used the bathtub to have a mud bath, then broke it. Oh, it's Koji's birthday almost. Broke the tub and then now it's just, just a mud bath all the time. Awesome. Great. Thanks. Hey, Quinn, do you want to do another painting? Because we actually need more money. <laughs> let's do, um, let's do landscape painting. That would be nice. All right, I'm going to do potty help from Rai because you need to go to the potty as well. Might as well do that while we're here. Okay, they became good friends. Very nice. Anki Rai helping out. And then you want to do a little bit of toilet time. Nice. There you go. What happened to Sandalwood? Did Sandalwood go to bed somewhere? Oh, Sandalwood's in the bed up here. Okay, fair enough. At least I got to sleep. That's good. I'm glad all the kids are sleeping now. Okay, we still, I did mention, um, I think Quinn to clean up, but we still have junk everywhere. <laughs> I get some free money out of it. Don't mind if I do. Some of these plates. There we go. Ah, it's like a relatively 
peaceful and sound. Oh, this needs to be an auto light. Should probably get some windows on this pop top. Hey, <laughs> it's pretty sad. All right, Quinn, what have we got here? Excellent quality painting. Don't mind if I do. Let's sell that to the art gallery. All right, then after you've gone poo poo, eventually. It's taking a while. There we go. A bit of money. Very nice. Got the potty skill. Good, good. Okay, Quinn, use the other toilet. We have another bathroom. What are you doing? Don't go to the one that people are currently in. All right, and then night night. Oh, yes, we completed the party. So night night from right. So we reward earned. Koji is a legendary host. Wait, Koji? No, it was it was Willow. Willow hosted. Tell three stories from a sleeping bag. Oh, dang it. That was one of my things. That's okay. We, we can do that separately. We don't... Uh, are you okay, dude? What happened? <laughs> Are you okay? The last sleeping bag, did that just vanish? You, wait, yours is still there. Uh, all right, so we've got an item in, in our household inventory for a reward. Oh, sleeping bags, cool, cool, cool. All right, that's good, so I don't have to buy them. Uh, are you right there, dude? Yeah, you're good. Okay, yours are disappearing now. All right, okay, the kids are heading off. Thanks guys for coming. I mean, you don't have to leave at 6 a.m. Like, is it a little longer? Uh, <laughs> the best avoid critter. The Arcticorn, of course. Okay, of course. All right, how are the other kids going? Oh, they've just... Oh wait, Sandalwood's still hanging out. <laughs> no, what are you doing? Aren't you supposed to be going to bed? Go to bed. No, don't sleep in the rocking chair, although that would be pretty comfortable. Why is there a plate of fish and chips in the bathroom? Who who even took that in there and put that there? Okay, <laughs> Sandalwood's heading off now. <laughs> right, well, that was pretty successful. That was a pretty good slumber party. I'm pretty happy with that. All right, well, let's finish up this episode by just getting some windows up on this thing because this is a very sad looking area up the top. Maybe we go like a couple there. Maybe get the small ones. We could do like one here, one there maybe. Yeah, and then maybe just do the same on the other side actually like this. Oh, and we could fit some at the back too. There you go, so there's some windows up there. We'll get a photo of our house from over here in a second. Um, the rest of the upstairs is pretty sad, but that's okay. Yeah, well, we need to change that anyway. You know, this whole house is always a work in progress. Now, if you did miss it, I did do a build video uh, last week on our new house, which is over there. This is where we're gonna move once we have more money. I mean, look at this place, it's huge. It's like a seven bedroom home. Most of it's single story. If you wanna check it out, the build video is on the channel. So do go back and check that. Um, but obviously we can't afford that. That's like $90,000 and our house is only worth 30,000 at the moment. That's still a little ways off, but we're working towards it. Uh, but in the meantime, we need to keep upgrading this one as best we can anyway. So let's get um, down to our photograph spot. Take a photo. Seems like nice lighting, so it's probably a good time to do it. I like how this, <laughs> this tripod is still here after all this time. Uh, oh, hang on. This is not right. What's happened? This is not the best angle to take photos of a house from, but that's okay. So we go a couple of large, a couple of medium, and a couple of small. That'll do. That'll do the trick. And then I'll do, um, I'll turn that into like a, a custom content photo too. But for now we'll use, not that one. One of these, here we go. Oops, I did. Uh, let's brighten that up as always, out of frame. Oh, white. Yeah, there we go. So we've got a little progression. I guess it should be down here. Oh, we'll, we'll figure out the layout better soon, but yeah. Got the new top on the house. Look at this, a little progress of our house is looking good. Uh, we should probably get progress photos of our kids as well at some point, but uh, that'll be for another day. Thanks so much for watching this part. That was actually kind of fun. We did the uh, learning to ride bikes where we started doing that. We'll keep doing that. And we also did the slumber party, which is pretty fun. And we got a second story on the house, which yeah, look, doesn't look great, but we'll work on it. We'll work on it for sure. We'll keep expanding this house as we need to uh, until we can afford the other house. I think we, if we want to get the house anytime soon, the other one, we're going to have to either just do a lot more painting with Quinn or I guess, I mean, Rye has a lot of potential to earn a lot of money from the comedy thing, especially with doing comedy routines. I think we can perform those and get more tips, but I don't know really how much that's going to earn us. Probably not that much. So we might have to focus a little bit more on painting. But until next episode, make sure to leave comments, suggestions and feedback down below. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching and have an awesome day.